Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to take a look at Major Geeks Registry Tweaks. Let's do this. There are over 80, and it will continue to grow. Collection of registry hacks and batch files that we've put on Major Geeks. They allow you to make really quick changes. We're going to show you how this works and play with a couple so you can see how safe they can be. However, you probably should back up your registry. Another thing you can do, go to this page in the video description, expand the description to find it. Click download now, get the file on your drive. You can also right here, paragraph one, download them individually. You can list them by popularity here and take a look at what everybody else is downloading and they like, or list it by name or list it by date to see what we just put up. See, pretty cool. So let's play around with this a little bit. I've got the file on the drive already, of course. What you'll do is find the file, click extract unless you have a third party tool like 7-zip, p-zip, WinRAR, you know what to do then. And click extract and that will open up all the files. I'm gonna move this over a little bit so you can see everything. And you can see all the different options here. There's literally something here for everybody if not more. One of my favorites, do you use Notepad a lot? Open with Notepad. Let's enable it. Click yes, click yes, click okay. That's what you're gonna do for every single one. Yes, yes, okay. So let's do, we're in downloads new because I didn't think ahead to make a text document. There we go. So now that we've applied that, watch this. Open with notepad. Ta-da. Don't wanna do that anymore? You're gonna do the same thing, but click remove. Yes, yes, okay. Gone. Pretty neat, right? All right, I was bouncing around for a little bit. I hit pause if your screen just flashed on you. Let's play around with some other stuff. How about showing your Windows 10 version on the desktop? Click yes, yes. Okay, you got the routine, right? Let's go over to the desktop and refresh it. F5. There it is. And to get rid of it. Yep. Yep. Okay. So yeah. Pretty neat, right? I think if you spend some time looking through here, you're going to find something for... I can't imagine there isn't somebody out there who's going to see something they like. There's some security stuff in here. You can disable the run dialog, task manager, screen savers. If you get more out of Windows, there are bug fixes, security stuff, automatic registry backup, power options, context menu stuff galore. If you've got something you use a lot, add the restart menu. That's a real cool one too. And there's your restart start menu. Pretty cool. And you just got to go through them all. And all that does, obviously, is refresh your start menu. But there's other stuff with power. And um, you can remove context menu items as well. I mean, there's really something in here for everybody. Add all tasks or God mode to control panel. Everybody loves control panel, right? Let's bring up control panel. There's all tasks right there. Basically your God mode. It's just happened to be called all tasks here. With million, Just think of the stuff you can have in here. Imagine getting your computer to work the way you want. But again, please back up your registry and or set a system restore point in case you change your mind. Almost everything in here, as you can see, is reversible. Another one of my favorites, add group policy editor. That would be a right click run as administrator because it's a batch file. So people who have Windows 10 Home can also enjoy the benefits of group policy editor. Just you can see all the fixes here and just some of it's just silly stuff rotating pictures very harmless and very cool and it's been well received i hope you like it as well and we thank you again for watching if you do go to download this feel free to bookmark that page and check back every couple of weeks or every month or so and you'll notice that we'll go from it was literally i put the file up a day or two for this video i've already got three more in there so it'll be updated as needed Thanks for watching. Thanks for all your support. The likes, the subscribes. We really, really do appreciate it. See ya.